A standard size golf ball has a diameter of 1.68 inches. The material used to make this golf ball weighs 0.6523 ounce per cubic inch. What is the weight to the nearest hundredth of an ounce of one golf ball? So if we're using a sphere to model the situation, we need to find a volume of the sphere or of the ball. And uh, we're going to use the volume of sphere formula to do that. And that would be four thirds pi r cubed. Since we're told the diameter is 1.68, so diameter is 1.68, the radius therefore will be 0. Uh, what is that? 0 0.84, right? And um, so once we find out what the volume is of the ball, then we can multiply that volume with the density to determine the weight. So let's punch this in, or let's substitute that in. So V is equal to 4 thirds pi times 0 0.84 cubed. And let's see what that is on the calculator. So I'm going to enter in 4 thirds times pi times 0.84 to the third. And that will give me 2.4827. So this is 2.4827 cubic inches. I'm not going to round until the very end, uh, and I am, uh, so now that I have the volume here, 2.4827 inches cubed, I want to convert this into uh, ounces. So the density that I'm given is zero, actually I use capital D because I use lowercase d already, is 0 0.6 five to three ounce per inches cubed. So one inch cubed. So in order for, uh, for me to cancel out the inches cubed in the volume that I just found, I have to have one inch cubed in the denominator and I'm gonna place 0 0.6523 ounces in the numerator. So when I multiply this across, uh, the numerator and denominator, those units will cancel, and I'm going to be left with a number involving only ounces. So I want to take that number that I found a moment ago, and I'm going to multiply it by 0.6523. So multiply that by 0.6523. I get 1.619. And the, it says to round to the nearest hundredth of an ounce. So this is approximately 1.62 ounces then. So 1.62 ounce, that would be option two.